Hey guys, this is Eric the Adpro, and right now I want to talk to you a little bit about how to stay motivated. Now, staying motivated is actually something that everyone struggles with. No matter if you're a professional athlete or fitness model, or maybe you're just an amateur who's just trying to get ready for their first show or photo shoot. Um, either way, you really have to be motivated in order to reach your goals. Uh, so there's a couple ways that you can do this. Um, one of the ways is you, you really have to sit down and determine what it is you're trying to accomplish. If you don't know what your goal is, you're never going to be motivated to achieve it. You know, if you, if you don't know what your destination is on a vacation or a trip, you're never going to get there. So first thing you have to do is to have a specific goal. So for example, let's say you want to get six pack abs. You need to be very specific with that. You don't just want to lose a couple pounds or you don't just want to get in shape. You want to have six pack abs, which means you want your body fat to be in the single digit numbers. Uh, also what that means is that you need to start giving yourself a deadline. A lot of people will set these goals and they never have a specific date that they need to meet them by. So what happens is that goal just gets procrastinated on, you know, it gets pushed back and, well, maybe next month, well, maybe next year, well, then it just never happens. So give yourself a deadline, but be realistic. Um, fitness is something that happens over time. Uh, I would say if you're not really in great shape or, I want to say in great shape, but let's say you, you, you're about average and you want to get six pack abs, try to give yourself four months, maybe six months. Um, if you're you know, a little bit overweight and you're, you want to get in amazing shape, you might want to give yourself a year. The thing is, is that this happens very slowly because your body doesn't want to get rid of fat. It wants to hold on to it as much as possible. So make sure you're specific and make sure you give yourself a deadline. Something else that really helps to stay motivated is to tell people about your goals and deadlines. Um, a lot of us, you know, if we, if we don't share it with other people, we don't feel like we really have to accomplish it. You know, we'll, we'll tell ourselves, hey, I'm gonna get, you know, six pack abs this summer, but we don't tell anyone about it. So if you don't have six pack abs this summer, you're not letting anyone down. But if you share that information with people, if you tell your friends and family, hey, I'm gonna have six pack abs this summer and I'm gonna compete in this show or I'm gonna do a photo shoot on this date, now you have people to hold you accountable because you don't wanna let them down. It just kind of makes it more real. There's a little bit more pressure, but it definitely works in, in my opinion. So I would say share your goals and deadlines with as many people as possible. Uh, one of the things that I do is I'll share my goals and deadlines with a lot of people on Facebook. Even though they don't know me, they start encouraging me and uh, and you know telling me you know great things about you know how you could how great I'm doing and my progress and and how excited they are for me. So you know do whatever you can to kind of share those goals. Now. There's also plenty of contests that you could join, and these are great for getting yourself in, in uh, amazing shape because they give you a specific deadline and there's a specific criteria you have to meet. So for example, right now I'm doing a couple competitions. I have uh, you know, a national men's physique competition in Vegas, which is going to be on July uh, 29th. And if I win that show, I'll get my pro card. So I have a specific goal right there that I'm trying to achieve. And I know I have to bring my best conditioning ever for that. Also, I have a photo shoot the week after, which is uh, gonna be with one of the top photographers in the fitness industry. So I know I have to be in amazing shape in order to do this photo shoot with this acclaimed photographer in the fitness industry. Besides that, I've also entered in a couple of other competitions, which are, you know, the PowerTech Spokes Model Search and the Men's Health Fittest Friends Contest. Now, I've included those links below. If you want to support me, feel free to go down there and vote. But, like I said, these 
type of competitions let people know about you and your goals and your deadlines so that you could be held accountable. So just to recap, if you're having problems staying motivated, you really need to set a specific goal, you need to set a deadline, you need to share this information with your friends and family, and you could join as many contests as you would like because these contests are set up to help give you exposure, to hold yourself accountable, and basically do all the things you need to do in order to get ready for shows and get in amazing shape. So I hope you found this information useful, and be sure to check back with appro.com. Thank you so much for watching.